Good day to you. My name is Marek Konjelska and this is Poland Daily Culture. And we ask yourself today a question, what do you see in the picture? So what do you see in the pictures which are right now behind us and which we are presenting to you? Because with us in the studio is a true artist, Mariusz Ołowski. Again, thank you very much for coming. Thank you very much. I know it's not easy to talk about art and especially pa paintings. You just have to see them. You have to look at them and every person sees something different. And usually it's, it's about emotions. It's about uh, this, uh, this relation to which we have with have the painting. Mm -hmm. And this is even deeper when it comes to your paintings because uh, it's not a figurative art, it's an abstract art. And you use different forms, different objects, different things. But um, you tell me you don't really have a plan for a painting. Yeah. You just start with something and it goes off and it goes somewhere else. Tell us about this process. For example, about this blue painting with made out of CDs. How did you do it? So when, when I found firstly these CDs, the, the, they were totally uh, impossible to use because they, they, they were damaged. Yeah, yeah. damaged. And uh, I, I just uh, put everything in one table and, and I was thinking, what now? How, how I can connect them? After, after one grill in my garden, I, I just put some, some CDs in one plate and uh, with, with big temperature, the, they were in new way to, to survive the, this, this hell, this temperature. And some CDs were connected and some, some CDs uh, uh, in, in opposite. Uh, because of this, now it's so like you're new. The map. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's like new map of uh, like in geographic style. You have scarification. You have different ways for for pigment, and the old time different different uh, image is different in aesthetic, in relief, in pigment, in structure, in condition. Some some art is made by glass. Uh, which I baked in in a baking machine. Some uh, some stuff are are totally totally um, explode like like ice creams. So, for example, different way it's more uh, like liquid when when uh, Coca Cola, which has bubbles, of course. These bubbles push this pigment somewhere in in uh, the in strange kind of spheres, circles, sugar on, on paper, take some pigment inside. And uh, it's, it's a little impossible to discover uh, by, by words. It's uh, necessary to see this in real. So you're experimenting, like physically trying to uh, show what's the um, what's the limit or the limitation of current material mm -hmm. and how can it shape, how can be, how, where can it take us, uh, where is the purpose, how to change it. And then, but as you said, uh, you're not trying to um, make us viewers uh, to bring some certain, very certain message, mm -hmm. but just to discover where this material take you, yes? Yes, and people can see everything because every everyone has different imagination, di different connection for shapes, different connection for colors, and th this is a very very big uh, power of this art. Uh, kids uh, can see small rabbits, small dogs, cats, and uh, older people maybe something like uh, like demons or or big tigers, uh, dangerous people, bandits. It depends totally of, of imagination. So what you have inside in uh, you. I, uh, <laughs> so a very <laughs> random question, but yeah. what was the, uh, I mean, the stranger thing someone said looking at your pictures? Mm, petit, petit prince. Which means? Uh, s small prince. Uh, with own planet and big bottle of, of alcohol, something like this. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's strange, of course, but someone saw it in your picture. Yeah. Well, that uh, sounds uh, very interesting, but also encouraging somehow us to, to look at where your, our imagination takes us. When, um, what would you like to advise 
uh, when people are looking at art, how to look at to art. To be totally neutral and uh, to, to remember every, every painting was made for something and is connected with different strange travel. So we sort of see this travel or this journey which these products and things needed to make in order to end up there. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Well, this is the clue and the recipe for you, the viewers of Poland Daily. If you ever think about how to uh, think about art, how to talk about it, how to uh, what to see there in a the painting, or maybe you don't know how to understand how to understand art, this is an encouragement and a recipe how to do it, to stay neutral, calm, and to think and remember about the journey and the travel, which all the products and materials needed to go through in order to end up at this piece of canvas. Again, thank you very much for watching our show and stay tuned.